Good evening, lords and ladies. Well, unless you're on the opposite side of the world than me, and then it's good morning. So for my buddy Gio, who's coming over from King of Avalon, he's like, hey, revenge. Um, I'm kind of a no-limits spender, and I'm going to go on a big spending spree and just build some shit up. I'm like, uh, a little bit surprised, but okay. Let's make sure this goes the right way instead of the wrong way. So hopefully, I'm going to give him some tips and pointers on how to best get set up before you just start building the shit out of everything. So let's start here. Lord Skills. And if you're a baby castle, you probably don't have many of these, but something is better than nothing. So you go here, you activate it. And if you're not VIP 22, which you probably won't be, spend a little bit of gold or whatever it is, put your skill points here. You know, 10, 10 construction, research, blah, blah, blah. Anyway, if you're familiar with King of Avalon, Lord Skills, this is your starting point, okay? Then your second point, let's go in the city. Your second point um, is going to be town mode. And town mode opens up pretty early. So, I mean, you should be able to free play, you know, get to town mode, you know, pretty quickly. But going to town mode. Wait a minute for the loading screen. And voila, we go here. So, what you want to do is you refresh this until you get the correct buff. I'm just gonna burn. I'm just gonna burn resources until I get it. I'm not gonna stop until I get it. It, it hates me, and it's not been giving me the things that I want lately. So that 15% research, yeah, I could have used you before. So they're toying with me. Uh, so I'm giving you an idea of how much silver you're gonna have to spend. Wow, they're really hating me. Super hating me today. They must really feel I don't want to do construction. So that 20% construction, you're going to want that, but mm, we got to do the first buff before we do the second buff. So it doesn't help us right now. Pow, the 10% construction. Now, um, I'm probably going to go with this just because, you know, whatever. So I'm just going to do that real quick. So you, you lock that first one in, and then you, oops. And then you go to your quests, and you just do a quickie quest. 10 points, finish now, whatever, it's fine. And you'll see... All right, well, come on. Oh, it requires 20, all right, there we go. So now you'll see that the first buff is activated. After the first one is activated, you can go back to this, this process again. How? We got 20% construction. You lock that in, and you do it for the third one. Okay, so Lord Skill, Town Mode, check. Then the other thing that we're gonna wanna do is there's two different buffs in here that you wanna activate. There is a Lord Experience buff and a Construction Boost buff. And let's see here, large size. Research, construction speed. And depending on how fast you're gonna be, here's the 30% one, here's you know the 15, you know, 30% uh, for an hour, you know, 15 minutes, blah blah blah. So anyway, you probably want to do 30% and just keep you know refreshing it as needed. And there's a Lord Experience one around here somewhere that you want to activate too, so that you get more Lord Experience. So it's basically more bang for your buck. Ah, here we go, Lord Experience Boost. You're also going to want to pop this 25% Lord Experience Boost because Lord Experience is a good thing, and if you're going to be doing a lot of building upgrades, it's going to help you out. So there's a, that's the second piece. Now we're going to go into the one of the last pieces, and that is ensuring that your hero is correct. Okay? So in this case, you start out with Harl, and I've never switched it off. You know, that's the hero that I've got. And there's a couple of ways that you can boost your hero to make him help with construction speed. The first off is leveling him. The second is these runes over here on the right-hand side. And you'll see it's 6%, 8%, 4% construction speed. 
Um, I have cheap, crappy rooms right now. I wish I could get better ones. You know, c'est la vie. So ruins will help a little bit. And then more importantly, you're going to come into this construction gear. So the construction gear is called Glorious. And what that is, is it's just basically five base pieces gives you the immortal bonus. And then if you have a level 40 hero, you can unlock the sixth slot and then pop another um, piece of equipment there to really double it up. And so you can see that my construction boost from, from this is 460%. And I can tell you, that's going to help you a whole heck of a lot. So you want to make sure that you have your construction hero on the architect slot. Make sure he's put there. Don't forget to put him there. Okay, and then the last thing is, um, and this isn't going to be something that everybody can take advantage of very often. Maybe talk to your king if you've got a friendly king. Um, but there's a, um, there's a kingdom bonus for... Um, for boosting. Let's see what it is. Nope, it's not that. Uh -uh. Oh, I think I'm maybe looking in the wrong spot. Forgive me, I'm still a noob. So, click on the capital, and I believe it's going to tell us the different types of boosts. Yeah, the kingdom research boost and the kingdom... Hmm. Nope. Not what I was thinking it was going to do. Well, shit, there's another boost. I don't know where it is. You have to forgive me, but it's a 10% speed up boost. And uh, maybe somebody can drop a comment, you know, telling me how much noob I am and where it is. But there's, a, there's another boost. I think it's activated by the king. And it lasted for like a day, and it basically gave 10% bonus on the speed ups. Maybe it's an event thing. I don't know, but it was really awesome. So there's also that thing. So when you really, really want to just push these levels you know, pop that. Because let me show you here as an example of how much this construction stuff really will make a difference. Because when you get to Stronghold 28 and you want to upgrade, you're looking at reducing 564 days down to 785-ish. Okay, and the last point, and depending on where you are in the game, maybe you're just new and you're just gonna start it from the beginning. If you're a little bit more seasoned, there's another thing that you can do too. And I believe it's this one. Construction speed. So this is something else that you can do, and it gives 22%. Not a lot, but not a little bit. And there's another construction thing over here, too, I believe. But I'm not sure the dependencies on this, to be honest with you. So because it has all these extra dependencies, it's probably not going to be very easy for you to unlock. So it's there. Keep it in mind. If you have it, great. If you don't, don't go out of your way to do it. I think really smashing research all at one time at a later, later point is the way to go. So we covered the buff, we covered the Lord skill, we covered the hero, we covered town mode, the kingdom thing, which I can't figure out. Um, is there anything else I'm missing? Well, if I'm missing it, I get to make another video in the future. So, okay. Love you guys and good luck, Gio. Bye-bye.